Okay, I'm going to talk to you a little bit about assignments. Now, here on my home page, I can just see all of the ePortfolios that I've created. You can make it as many as you'd like. But down here are the courses that I'm involved with. I'm an instructor in this course, but I'm a student in this course. So I'm going to show you what it's like to upload an assignment as a student. So I click on my course that I'm a student in. I go to list and it gives me the list of all my assignments I have to do. Now, they are color-coded. If there's yellow next to them, it means it's completed. If it's orange, it means I'm waiting for a reply from the faculty member. But if it's blue, it means as a student, I have to submit something. So I'm gonna click on this assignment as an example, and you might get some information about the parameters of the assignment. But it's down here that's really important. This is where you add your evidence or your paper. Now you can add it as a paper by browsing, finding the document. This is portfolios, paper. Click on it and it's going to upload. There's also um, a way of looking at one of your ePortfolios, submitting this to your, to your faculty member. So I'm going to click on this portfolio that I created, Portfolios, and I want them to go and look at the section or page called Papers. When you're done, you can add some comments if you like. You could add a rich text if you like, but mostly you're just going to submit. And then you know that you're waiting for the faculty to comment on what you've done.